Send me over. I'll have him back before you can say tiddlywinks. Okay, well, I will, but you will be training a partner on this trip. Officer Dendar. How you doing? I've heard so much about you. Huge fan. You are the best, and I'm learning from the best. And I know that. You know what? You're the boss. You're the boss. Yeah, last I checked, the boss was Bruce Springsteen. There is no way I'm training this guy, all right? I'm going alone. Is that understood? And it's time to make a move. You're moving into Temporal Police. You're working underneath me. I want you to follow the rules. Do you understand? One of these days, you'll have that badge. Does that mean anything to you? Yeah, it does. Welcome to Heroes Haven, home of the best of Marvel, the best of DC, Ray Blast, Alpha, Force 9, Deep Space, The Incredible Hulk, Batman, Spider-Man, Superman. Please, please be quiet. I'd like to purchase your establishment. <laughs> yeah, sure you do. So, my mama, my mama's mama, and my mama's mama's mama. Hey, you with me? Yeah, this here's the place. Okay. Ah, oh, come on, man. Give me a break. I'll give you a break, all right. Get him out of me. I don't want to go back. Listen, this guy's kind of an old friend of mine, Aban Sewell. Uh, I'm going to sneak around the back. Oh, I see. Well, dude, yeah, dude, dude. TV's awesome. You watch Batman, Superman, you got Spider-Man, the Hulk. Really? Yeah, Hulk's right here. You got Spider-Man right here. Oh, oh, that, they're from so all you, the So you've met this guy? No, he's also, it's, it's all make-believe. It's all science fiction. So that's his name, Hulk? The Incredible Hulk, yeah. Mm -hmm. So his last name is Hulk. No, 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 name no. Incredible. She's a strong female leader of a group of superheroes called the X-Men. His comic books make for interesting reading. Get yourself a TV. It's very entertaining. You can see Green Lantern's ring. Great. I heard you've been looking for me. Listen, I got found you first. It's time to take care of some unfinished business. Please, explain that to me. The guy yelled out, hey, your car sucks. And I said, sucks what? And then you decided to race him? Yeah, he said, I'll beat you to the next light. And I still didn't know what he meant. So you took the Phantom Cruiser, a $10 million piece of technology, to drag race some civilian? Yeah, I did. Unbelievable. Well, did you win? Hell yeah, I won. I blew that boy away. Third, and this is a good one, it took seven techs to clean some substance from 230 million years ago, the Triassic period, off the Phantom Cruiser. You took the Phantom Cruiser to go see some dinosaurs. Let me tell you something about the Punisher. The Punisher, Frank Francis Castle, we call him Frank Castle, his family was killed. So he went on a big vigilante killing thing, and it was just great to see him just destroy the people that killed his family. And then he was living underground because, you know, he became so, so bad. And they were like, you cannot kill people like that because that is illegal. You're not supposed to do stuff like that. And that is just wrong. The man should go out and have his revenge, but it's not revenge, it's punishment. Oh no. Hold it, Dom Singh! One more move, and I'm sending you back! Oh. Damn! Oh, I'll kill you! New kill prisoner you. has arrived in holding area C-14. Where am I? Who are you? Prisoner! Your powers have been drained. Now move for sentencing. Right there, we got a portal there. Let's hit it. Yeah, thanks for not resisting. What can you do? You always find me. 
Three to teleport. All right, look. I want you to take her to processing. I got somebody I want to see over here while we're here. Hey, wait. I thought you were letting me go. Hey, princess. We're doing this to make sure we keep you on record that you jumped. Yeah, because if you do it again, we're putting you away. Hey, we're cutting you some slack here, all right? All right. Hey, this is serious. Do you understand? Yes, yes. Just take me to processing already. <laughs> you heard her. Take her to processing. Like I said, I got somebody here I want to see, and then I want you to meet me back at headquarters. Okay, well, wait. Wait, headquarters across the hall or headquarters over there? No, not headquarters here. McDonough and Delson work over here now. We work over on the other side. Headquarters on the other side. So on the other side or this side or the other side? The no. other side. Yes, the other side. So you mean under Heroes Haven? Yes, the comic book shop that you love so much, 600 feet below the surface of it. That's where I want you to meet me after you process her. Okay. All right. I'll be there. Okay, go Let's processor. Go. What is a day off anyway? Well, a day off is when you have free time from work. Dude, that was awesome! How do we do that? It's a wormhole. I do it all the time. Oh, it's time! That's awesome! Dude, we're in Evor! I have a Captain Anru. She's, you know, she's really tough. You know, the guy who runs a comic book store, Eldon. Hey, you! You gonna buy anything today? Who, me? No, the invisible girl over there. Oh, thank goodness she's here. I'm flat broke. Unbelievable. Ah, that's so funny. Why doesn't he remember me? Why are you laughing? <laughs> Come on. I heard the whole conversation about you and Davis and, uh, you know, me and him went to Ebor this morning with the wormhole. It was so cool. He told me the whole thing, like, like you guys like secret agents, like James Bond. You guys, like, are time uh, space patrollers, like Green Lantern Corps and the Guardians of the Galaxy. And the See, it's so cool that you guys have, like, a secret car and a headquarters. You go past this curtain over here and he goes way down his elevator like 600 feet I don't know where it is but dude I will keep it a secret I will zip it Bobby Cooper keeps a secret <laughs>